What's up guys and welcome. You are watching Fuzzy Fitness. Michael Krizosko just released his latest physique updates as he is just days out of his IFBB Pro debut. In the next 48 hours, Michael is gonna keep drawing out and keep getting harder. So this isn't the final package. Will Krizos Pro debut be a walk in the park? It can be as the lineup isn't very deep. Not one former Olympian is competing here in Prague. And Michael Krizos' size is very overwhelming. I think we are gonna see a much better version here than what we saw at his NPC debut. And he purposefully didn't peak 100% when he won his pro card simply because he didn't need to. The front double is a great shot for Krizo. Do you guys think he can improve the execution of that pose if he crunches his abs while hitting it? Because criticism on Michael's posing is legit. AJ was the best coach for Justin Rodriguez and no one can dispute that. That man helped Justin place as high as 8th at the Olympia. He peaked him to perfection at the Arnold Classic and Boston Pro this year. And not to mention the Chicago Pro 2020 which was Justin's best look and he himself admits that. I still do not understand why Justin parted ways with AJ over one bad showing, which was in the pro this year. So Justin hired George Farrow afterwards and we saw how off he looked at Legion Sports. That was clearly his show to win and people didn't even have him in the second place at Legion. So turns out now Justin isn't working with George Farrow either and he has now hired a new coach and is now working with Umar Eduardo for his Olympia prep. Do you guys think this new combo can beat his Boston Pro package in 7 weeks? Brian Asley's latest physique update is an answer to anyone who thinks that he won't be ready on time. This will be Brion's seventh and last Olympia in classic physique category. He is a two times Mr. Olympia in 2017 and 2018, beating Chris Bumstead. Will it be difficult for Brion to retain the top three spot this year? Yes, there is no doubt about it. The guys he is trying to hold off are very young and arguably have more aesthetic shapes. And on top of that, they have already beaten him this year at the Arnold Classic. But Brion has no other option other than coming in insanely shredded and beat some of these guys in the back shots. Hopefully, the athletes will have enough time after weigh-ins to carve up properly and fill out. Behros Tabani makes it to Dubai Muscle Show and gives his fans a sneak peek of what he is bringing to Romania Pro in 15 days. If I'm not mistaken, Romania was his first and only pro show that he did and he made a lot of fans around the world because of the conditioning he brought to the stage and we can't wait to see him back on stage again. Muhammad Fada is still prepping although his Spain visa was rejected. So the next option will be Romania. Hopefully he gets to compete there. Fada was also spotted in Dubai training alongside the Persian Wolf Hadi Chopan and his coach Hani Rambod. Hit the thumbs up button if you like the video and smash the subscribe button if you wanna come back for more. Thanks for watching.